Uh, okay, then, boys, today I'll be doing a player review on the new Big Willy Orban. Um, it's good that I put the Orban on that. Otherwise, it's been said Big Willy. But the first thing we're going to have a look at is, is additional info. So we, we're going to have a look at how much we think he's going to get upgraded. Now, RB Leipzig played yesterday um, as I'm recording this. And they did win. So And they did score four. So it's fairly possible, you know, if they maybe get a couple goals against Real Madrid. Um, which, you know, it's not great. Um, but they do have Darmstadt and Cole next, who are quite shit. So, you know, they might score the goals and that might already get an upgrade for him. But in terms of clean sheets, well, they might get a clean sheet, actually, considering that they do keep a few clean sheets here and there. And they have got Darmstadt next, who are quite bad. Uh, and he did play their last game, so that's already one of the three appearances. Um, and he'll probably play the rest of the Bundesliga game, bearing in mind he doesn't get injured. So this could, honestly, boys, this, this is probably, this well... It's got like a 70% chance, probably a very high chance of being a 4 upgrade here. Um, so let's actually jump into the play analysis now then. 6 at 1, low high, 2 star, 3 star, right foot, most of Fairly ideal start there, we'd like that. Uh, he plays a lot of RB Leipzig. It could be, well, there's, there is a few Hungarians in the Bundesliga, but I'd rather just try and link him to RB Leipzig players to get him to 3 cam. Um, so not too hard to link him, but could be a bit difficult. In terms of the pace, it looks good, very nice, good shooting. Passing is a bit of an L, boys. He's got all right on the short pass and long pass, but it's a bit below, you know, what we're getting nowadays. And the vision is absolutely atrocious. So a lot of his passes are going to be going, you know, you could be aiming at your centre mid and it could go to the right back, really, which is a bit annoying. Uh, he's got low agility and balance, but that's okay in this game. Um, I don't mind at the moment, only in low ball control and low dribbling. But he's got really good defending and really good physical, boys. So it's actually a very, very nice card. Um, and let's actually have a look at the play styles then, because this is what makes a card at the moment. He's got power header, which is good. Long ball pass, nice. Intercept jockey. Anticipate plus, that's nice. He's got basically all the good defending ones. And he's got aerial. So he actually could be a massive aerial threat. And he also is um, going to be a little bit clunky on defence. But if you find someone else who's a little bit smaller, maybe 5'11", 5 uh, who's got good agility and balance and a little bit better acceleration on the pace and you know it'd be fine and he'd actually be a very very good card uh, and if you can find a way to link him for 26.5 chaos that's an absolute steal lads